Hey there, and welcome to Ryan's tutorial about layers. In this tutorial, we will explore the concept of working with layers to organize your architectural drawings, and we will review the layer panel. Let's get started. Layers can be found in the left property panel. They're meant to help you organize your drawings so you can work more efficiently. Layers contain the drawing elements on your canvas, like your geometries, blocks, text, and they can even contain other layers. From the property panel, each layer can be locked and unlocked, shown or hidden, and their state will be applied to all the contained elements within them. The layer list is rendered from top to bottom, meaning elements at the top of the list appear above elements at the bottom of the list. You can easily rearrange the position of elements within a layer or the layers themselves by dragging and dropping them to adjust their location. You can create a new layer by clicking on the plus button on the layer panel and edit the layer's name by double clicking on it. The layer property will also appear on the right side panel. Let's draw something onto our layer. The layer we created is now the active layer, meaning anything we draw is placed directly on it, which is indicated with the black tick. You can also set a layer color. The color you choose will be applied to the layer's elements when it's moving to wireframe mode. Keep in mind that a layer can be placed within another layer, making it its parent layer. Layers without a parent will be marked as root, as you can see in their properties panel on the right. Lastly, remember that you can always change the layer an object is assigned to by simply selecting the element and editing its layer property in the property panel. And that's everything you should know about working with layers in Ryan. Check out our YouTube channel for more useful, hands-on tutorials, and don't forget to subscribe. See you in the next Ryan tutorial.